Good morning, everybody. Gene Rathman here, Try New Stuff Guy, with my lovely bride, Danielle. Today we have a trial of three Wish products. And these Wish products are eggshell crack openers or egg... Some way to open egg up openers. eggs. Egg openers, yes. So I'll put a picture here, here, and here to show you what we're expecting. In the pictures, you can see that these eggshells are cracked open perfectly. So we're going to try that with these things here. Like that, so you can see. So looking at these things, they, they look kind of barbaric. So this one right here looks like it is a penile torture device. So it looks like it goes on the penis and he goes, tell me what I want to know. So I'm not quite sure how that one's gonna work. That was just terrible. Yeah, I know. This one here looks like a... Uh, um, Something to do with circumcision. Yeah. So you put your little John Thomas in there and you go whoosh, and, you, and you cut the tip off. So that's, uh, I'm not sure how that's gonna do on an egg. I don't even have one and that hurts. Yeah, and, and this one, it, much like this one, I guess, works on percussion. You kind of, you know, whack it with a, I don't know. So we're gonna see how this works out here. So what I have here is I spent all night slaving over a hot stove Boiling some eggs. So all we night. have all night long, full 20 minutes. We have six raw eggs and we have six hard boiled eggs. So we're gonna try a couple of each one on each one of these devices and see how it works out. And uh, we'll figure out if they're worth the money from Wish or not. So in the video, I think they had a raw egg on there. So I'm guessing it just goes, I'm doing it over the bowl here. A good idea. All right, I'll hold it and you, you whack it. Ready? Ready. One, two, three. Num. Oh, it's got a little crack on it. Ooh. You can see. I you can see it. Come on, focus. Ooh. You can see a little crack right there. So it's got potential. Maybe she just didn't whack it hard enough. We'll try it one more time here to see if I can line it up. All right, try it one more time. Ready? Get one, a good grip on it. All right. Two, three. Eww. Ooh. Oh hey. Oh. Oh. It's got a like lot bigger crack on it. Come on, focus. There we go. Okay. And it went away. It's too much light. There we go. Yeah. So it's got a pretty good crack on it. It might have some possibility. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see. Hey. Hey. Big finger man. Ooh. That's so cool. It's got possibilities. Maybe you just gotta really whack the heck out of it. Look at the membrane. Yeah. That's neat. Insane in the membrane. All right, so it did crack it. All right, now I'm gonna try it here. You wonder if maybe it would fit better on the bottom of the egg? It's maybe. rounder. I'm really gonna pull this sucker back and watch it fly. Because as you people know who order stuff from Wish, there's never directions, and if they are, they're in Japanese or something. Here we go. Oh, oh. I go there. Oh, I think it worked. Oh, it oh, worked. Oh, look at there. Haha. Oops. Bottom of the table. A messy. All right, so there's our outcome. Almost perfectly like the picture. That's pretty good. So the deal with this one is, is you really, really have to pull it back. Super really far. Really high, yeah. So it definitely works on percussion, where it whacks the heck out of it. We have a lot of eggs for breakfast. All right, let's try it on a hard-boiled egg. 
Want to try it on the hard boiled egg? Trying to whack it? Sure. That sounds promising. That definitely worked. Oh, probably shouldn't do it right over that, huh? Well, it doesn't come off perfectly, but it comes off pretty good. Yeah, so it's a great way to start it instead of, you know, whacking it on a table, I guess. But I think this one's mainly made more for raw eggs. Mm -hmm. So you don't have to peel them. Yeah. All right. Let's try... Want to try the circumciser? Well, that's really up to you. Look at that. Wow. All right. I'm going to try the circumciser. So this one's kind of broken. One of the springs is broken on that one, or, or I don't know if that's the way it's supposed to be, but it's really loose on that side. All right, here we go. So I'm stick it in there. Scottish. And there's the boy coming out of the bathroom. <laughs> the bed of that part. Toilet flush. <laughs> All right, so we got a super, super zoomed in close one here. Let's we'll see if this works. <laughs> pushes pushes up from the egg. Oh. Really got a crank on that sucker. Really? Yeah. Alright, so I guess that does kind of work as well. But you really gotta push on it, otherwise it pushes up against the egg itself. All right, so I think what this one here is more for the hard-boiled ones. So you can try a hard-boiled one or you can try the raw one. I'll try a hard-boiled one. Just... <clears throat> Circumcise that egg. So it kind of did it, but... I personally like, you know, cracking the eggs and, you know, peeling it off myself. So this would be a waste of my time for the hard boiled egg. Very sad. I don't know if it's worth getting this thing to crack a raw egg either. It's just as easy to crack it on the side of a bowl and open it up. But I mean, it's fun. It's got some fun points to it. Eh. Now let's try the torture device. Dun, dun, dun. So this one probably works the same way as the other one using percussion like whacking hard into it But it's got the ball that slides up and you drop it onto the egg Let it fall <clears throat> But with as, as hard as we had to whack it with this one I don't know if that one's gonna get hard enough to whack it good enough or something But, mm -hmm. but you're going for distance So this is higher up than that one is it's heavier one way to find out do it do it so i'm gonna do a raw egg should i do yeah maybe i'm gonna do the the fatter end so i've got Does a little bit better? more to work with well i mean it just goes down lower uh, try both of us. We got plenty of eggs. So there's nothing in it, so it's not like there's a little needle or anything, so. No, I didn't feel anything on that. Oh. Take a look at it. Oh. So oh I changed goodness. my mind and I actually did the little end, and when I lifted this piece off, it was kind of like a suction, and that's when I felt the crack. Oh, this one actually, I think, worked really, oh, this was perfect. Whoa! That was awesome. I mean, look how perfect that is. 
I gotta try that one. That was cool. Here we go. Three, two, one, fire! Tell me what I want to know. <coughs> it's got little cracks on there. Maybe Danielle has the better touch to it. Mine was better. Yeah, hers is way better. It went all the way around with hers. Mine kind of went halfway. Were you holding it down? Like really on the egg really hard? I'm not just sitting it on top. Oh, that's, that's the difference. That's what I did. Ah. Is I held it on. But it still came off. Yeah, it still popped off pretty good. I just had to like pry it out a little bit. I wonder if I could do these all these eggshells like this. I don't know. Fill them with confetti and kind of tape it back on. And then throw them at people. Ha <laughs> um, ha! No. Alright, so we'll get this out of the way. Well, are we going to try... Yeah, we got to try the hard-boiled one now. Yeah. So that one is already cracked. So all right. this one, with this one... See how my... I'm wondering if you're not holding it the same way. I'll see if it works on hard-boiled. It didn't go all the way around this time either. So see the crack? And then it kind of gets less and less on the back side. But it definitely had some suction to it for sure. Alright, I'm going to try something with a circumciser here. Are we going to keep calling it the circumciser? That one kind of is. Sorry. Yeah, it, it kind of is a circumciser. So, I'm going to try it this way here, but give it a twist. Oh. So, kind of crack it in there. Oh. <laughs> so, it, uh, I don't know how well you can see that one there, but it has the egg white inside the shell. So... Oh, it, mm, yeah. I think it lives up to its name. Yeah. Oh. It took the foreskin and everything with it. I don't know. All right. So let's rate these things. Uh, <clears throat> out of these, Danielle, which one do you think is the better one to open raw eggs? The tall one. This one here? Yeah. Okay. So she oh. likes this one. I kind of like I this one. I kind of like that one, too. Yeah. Once you figure out how far to pull back on this thing, yeah. it, it really got some oomph behind it. And it just sort of shatters, localized that eggshell. Yeah. So for raw eggs, I like this one better. I don't know about you. But this one works really good for the for the raw eggs. I don't think any of them worked really well for the hard-boiled eggs. Uh, I think overall this one here is just a waste of money unless you want to torture adult men with something. Uh, but for opening eggs, I think this one's kind of just a waste of money. Uh, this one I think is more fun, and I think if I had more practice with it, I can make it work better like she does. Um, but ultimately, I think this one's the best one. This one's like maybe like a close second. Yeah. And this one, it, just don't waste your time on that one. So. Keep your money. Yeah, keep money on that one. So we're going to go uh, cook up our egg breakfast this morning. Uh, you folks have fun. Let us know in the comments down below if you want to see some other trial items. I do have... you grab that white thing next to uh, the bamboo? I do have something that I bought from the white shop a while ago. I was going to try it today, but I totally forgot about it. Let me know if you want to see this one. But this one here is a hard-boiled egg shaper. So you put a hard-boiled egg inside of there and you close it down and it shapes your eggs in these two shapes. So it's pretty cool. Uh, looking forward to trying it, but this one's a heart shape, this one's a star shape. Let us know if you want us to try this one and see how well it works out. Uh, but give a like and subscribe, tell your friends, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.